Hi everyone, welcome back to Prakasham Tutorials. In my previous videos, we have discussed the concept of coherent PPSK, coherent PPSK modulator and demodulator, and four spectra of the coherent PPSK and bandwidth of the coherent PPSK signal. In this video, I am going to discuss about bit error rate or error probability of the PPSK signal. So we know that the expression of the BPSK signal is given by x of t is equal square root of 2ps cos of omega ct. In binary phase shift keying for binary symbol 1g, for binary symbol 1 and binary symbol 0, the equivalent expressions is given by is written as for binary symbol 1 the carrier signal x1 of t is equal square root of 2 ps cos of omega c t where omega c is the angular carrier frequency ps is the power signal for binary symbol 1 it has a 0 degree phase shift and binary 2 the carrier waveform is x2 of t is equal minus square root of 2 ps cos of omega c t in binary 2 it has 180 degree phase shift so from binary 1 and binary 2 that is x1 of 2 and x2 of t we have x2 of t is equal minus x1 of t. x2 of t is equal minus x1 of t. So we know that the expression for the expression for error probability of an optimum filter is given by okay. We have to use matured filter for the detection of binary phase shift keying signal. The expression for error probability of an optimum filter is given by p suffix e is equal 1 by 2 error function of x01 of t minus x02 of t divided by 2 root 2, 2 root 2 sigma. And this is the equation of the error probability of an optimum filter. So, which is considered as equation 1. The expression for signal to noise ratio of the matured filter is given by x01 of t minus x02 of t divided by sigma is equal 2 by n0 integral minus infinity to infinity magnitude of x of f whole square df where n0 is the power spectral density of the noise and x of f is the frequency response of the filter. So using Rayleigh's energy theorem, we know that integral minus infinity to infinity magnitude of x of f whole square df is equal integral minus infinity to infinity x square of t dt is equal integral 0 to t x square of t dt. The limits of integration of the, this expression equation number 3 are 0 to capital T because x of t is present only over one bit interval. x of t, the signal x of t is present only one bit interval capital T. And now substituting this equation 3 into equation 1, equation 3 into equation 2, substitute equation 3 into equation 2, we get the signal to noise ratio of the matured filter is x01 of t minus x0 of t by sigma whole square is equal 2 by n0 integral 0 to t x square of t dt. But we know that the signal x of t is x1 of t minus x2 of t and for binary phase shift keying x2 of t for binary phase shift keying and the binary symbol uh, it is translated from one symbol to another symbol the carrier wave will have 180 degree phase shift so for binary phase shift keying signal x2 of t is equal to minus x1 of t and substitute x2 of t is equal to minus x1 of t into this equation x of t is equal to 2 times of x1 of t but x1 of t is equal square root of 2 ps cos of omega ct and substitute that value into this equation we get x of t is equal 
2 into square root of 2 ps cos of omega ct where omega c is the angular carrier frequency and p suffix s is the power signal and substituting this x of t value into equation 4 substituting this x of t value into equation 4 we get the signal to noise ratio value is x01 of t minus x0 of t 0 to of t by sigma whole square is equal 2 by n naught 2 by n naught and this is x of t value here x square of t x square of t is 4 into 2 ps 4 into 2 8 ps cos square of omega ct dt so now simplifying the rhs term of this integration the rhs term of this equation so cos square of omega ct cannot be integrated directly so cos square of omega ct is written in terms of cos s so cos square of omega ct is equal 1 plus cos 2 omega ct by 2 therefore x0 1 of t minus x0 of 0 2 of t by sigma whole square is equal 16 ps by n naught integral 0 to t 1 plus cos 2 omega ct by 2 into dt so applying the integration into both the terms so rhs side integral integral of first term plus integral of the second term now we are 2 8 16 divided by 2 8 so therefore 8 ps by n naught into integral 0 to t 1 dt plus integral 0 to t cos of 2 omega ct dt integral 1 dt is t over 0 to capital t integral cos of 2 omega ct is sin 2 omega ct by 2 omega c over 0 to capital t and now applying in the first term applying upper value of upper value and lower value of small t similarly in the second term applying upper value and lower value of small t and after simplifying we get we get x0 1 of t minus x0 of t by sigma whole square is equal 8 ps by n naught into t plus sin of 2 omega ct by 2 omega c so the value of the second term the second term of the rhs term is 0 if the second term of the rhs term of the 0 we get the signal to noise ratio x0 1 of t minus x0 of t by sigma whole square is equal 8 ps capital t divided by n naught but ps into t the energy signal e is equal ps into t so the multiplication of power signal into power signal into duration of the signal is energy of the signal and substitute ps into t is equal to energy of the signal we get we get x0 1 of t minus x0 2 of t by sigma whole square is equal 8 e by n naught so take the square root on both sides we get x0 1 of t minus x0 of t by sigma is equal square root of 8 e by n naught and substitute this maximum value into equation 1 and what is equation 1 equation 1 is the error probability expression and substitute this value into equation 1 we get the error probability of the binary phase shift keying as p is equal 1 by 2 error function of 1 by 2 root 2 into square root of 8 e by n naught and simplifying rhs term of this within the bracket term we get the error probability is 1 by 2 error function of square root of e by n naught where capital e is the energy signal or the bit energy signal and n naught is the power spectral density of the noisy signal and this equation is called as error probability of bpsk with matched filter receiver this equation p is equal 1 by 2 error function of square root of e by n naught e by n naught is the 
error probability of PPSK signal with matter filter receiver. So this expression for this expression for bit error probability. So this equation, this error probability equation indicates that the probability of the error depends on energy content of the signal. Capital E is the energy of the signal. It does not depend on the shape of the signal. As the energy of the signal increases, the value of the error function will decreases. The value of the energy signal increases and the value of the error probability or error function will decreases. And the probability of the error will also reduce. And this is the concept of the bit error rate or error probability of coherent BPSK signal.